What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Mr. Lightwork. Lightwork for sure. And today, I'm bringing y'all a short clip, all right? Short clip of Madden 22 deep dive in reference to the dynamic gameplay, all right? Now, I'm going to play the clip for y'all and everything. Then, we're going to break it down a little bit. I'm going to give y'all my feelings, my, you know, how I look, looking at certain things, uh, what has changed, you know, what they made better, what they made worse. You know, we're just going to jump into it just a little bit, all right? Now, if you're new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. Also, hit that bell icon so you know when my videos do drop, all right? But let's jump in. All right, guys, so what do y'all think? All right, so if you haven't played the beta for Madden 22, you give me your opinions in the comment section, all right? Now, if you played the beta for Madden 22, you played it already, and you experienced some of these things, I wanna hear from the people that have not played in it, that have not played the beta, excuse me, that has not got their hands on it like we have, you know, being YouTubers and just being people that was able to sign up for the beta. So let me know how you feel about the, um, the changes in the comment section, all right? But let's break it down, all right? Let's break down the few clips. All right, first thing, you saw some of the super fans, the new crowd reactions, stuff like that. Now, I felt they should have went out and found the super fans, probably for each team, you know, and kind of integrated them in the game. I mean, a lot of these fans, you know, some of them are older, but some just want to be a part of the football team so even if it's a game they probably would have done it for free you know that that wouldn't have been a big deal so all right so let's talk about the next clip so the play art okay you got squiggly lines you know how are people going to handle that all right now if you don't know that feature does come from ncaa uh you know when you're winning the game and you're in death valley or you're you're in the home team you can truly mess up the play art for the other team. I mean, literally, you can't make no audibles. Sometimes your receiver won't even get the play. It would mess the whole the whole offensive play up or that sequence or whatever. So that was a good feature. Now, I'm kind of mad that they actually lifted it off of NCAA, but it can be a win. You know, loud stadiums like um, Seattle, you know, different places like that where they 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 call their crowd the 12th man. That's legit. You know, that's legit. You got to go with more silent reads, silent snap counts. You have to actually do more hand signals than you would usually do in a regular football game because it's that loud. The next clip is of the weather. Like they're in Chicago, so the wind is gonna push the the trajectory trajectory of the of the ball once it's kicked all right so you have to angle it more to the right or to the left because when you kick it right it's gonna come back left okay now this was in Madden mini games some years back um you know so this was already in the game I don't know why they took it out but these are some some older features um I feel like they should have kept this in the game. I don't know why EA goes and takes things out and, and, and everything like that and then put it back in like it's something new. Because it's not. It's not new. Um, so with those three, four, three, four things, is it a win? I don't know. Like, I'm going to be honest with y'all. I don't know because a lot of this stuff was already in the game. Oh, and the last thing. I'm sorry. The last thing. Certain stadiums have certain momentum or certain effects on the away team, such as stamina when you come to mile high, which I think that is a real thing, which is kind of like probably one of the coolest features that they added into the game because a lot of players or um, a lot of teams go to Denver and they, they struggle with breathing. They struggle with um, stamina and stuff like that. So you see more oxygen tanks on their sideline, different things like that. So other than those features, man, what do y'all think? Y'all just let me know in the comment section. Um, to me, I feel like 
I have to wait and see about the momentum, the full version of the momentum shift and how it affects the game of the weather and the wind and stuff like that, you know, was already in the game once before and they took it out. Now they put it back in. So those type of things I would love to see or I would love to hear y'all opinions and read y'all opinions and everything like that. But to me, I'll give it a six out of ten. Okay, six out of ten. Uh, the reason why I even gave it a six is because of the stamina thing from my high. Like, that's really where they get a lot of credit because, you know, that's a real thing. That's a real thing. And everybody wants Madden to be real football, even though it cannot be. But that's the end of the video, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed my short, you know, brief video. You know what I'm saying? I just wanted to get it, get this out here to y'all and give, give y'all my opinions about the little short trailer. Um, let me know how y'all feel in the comment section. But I am out. When you do the work, you see the light, man. It's your boy, Light Work. We are gone. Peace.